Another victory for Donald Trump today. The Democratic-controlled House of Representatives failing to overturn the U.S. president's first veto. That outcome somewhat paving the way for Trump to move forward with his national emergency declaration at the U.S.-Mexico border that will direct billions of dollars, some earmarked for other government projects, to the construction of Trump's long-promised wall along the southern border. But there are still legal challenges against Trump's emergency declaration set to go to federal courts. The Mueller report was great. It could not have been better. As for developments on special counsel Robert Mueller's Russia report, which officially wrapped up last week and saw U.S. Attorney General William Barr release a four-page summary on Sunday, the U.S. House Judiciary Committee today unanimously approved a resolution directing the Justice Department to give Congress all records on FBI obstruction of justice or counterintelligence probes against Trump. The bipartisan move sending the measure to the full House for a possible floor vote that could give Barr two weeks to comply. According to Barr's summary, Mueller found no proof the Trump campaign conspired with Russia, but it also did not exonerate the president on the question of obstruction of justice. Trump again today expressing frustration. Mueller's investigation was allowed to go ahead in the first place. I think what happened is a disgrace. I don't believe our country should allow this ever to happen again. This will never happen again. Now there's a different but not unrelated deadline coming from Democrats. The six House committee chairs are debating that Barr released the full Mueller report to Congress by April 2nd, a week from today. Will he comply? For now, we're just going to have to wait and see.